From a simple high school class to becoming a finalist for one of the country's most prestigious awards in the culinary industry. One Navajo chef from Fruitland was a finalist for a James Beard Award. It's one of the nation's most prestigious awards in the culinary industry. News 13's Carlos Sosa tell, tells, tells us how a class in high school sparked his interest in cooking. <laughs> he looked on the James Beard page and he's like, oh my gosh, I'm a finalist. And we all were just screaming. We were just crying. It was really a good, it was a really special moment. Justin Paiochi was just one of five chefs in the finals for the Best Chef Southwest category for the James Beard Awards. That's a national recognition for exceptional talent and achievement in the culinary arts. Justin used to cook for his siblings growing up in Fruitland in the Four Corners. But it was a high school competition that showed him he can do more in the culinary world. In 2014, he graduated from Arizona Culinary Institute and worked at different restaurants. From there, his life changed while on a family vacation in Florida and meeting celebrity chef Robert Irvine. I appreciate him and everything that he does for the restaurant business and it's nice to meet him and then he sat down talked with me for a while and told me I need to get to some real cooking and so he called Bo McMillan and asked Bo to give me a job. In 2020 Justin created Paiochi Food Group with his sister and mother and since then they've been able to take their dishes all over the world. And we've been able to travel to uh, Alaska, we've been um, to Wisconsin, and we did a four course dinner in Italy in an Italian castle, which was awesome. It was for 75 people. Cooking different food with a modern twist. Justin says they stay true to their culture when they cook Navajo dishes. But if we choose to do any Navajo foods, um, we won't play with the recipes so much. We try to stay true to it, but the presentation is what's uh, totally different. Justin, along with his mom and sister, Tia, were on hand for the James Beard Award ceremony earlier this month in Chicago. And although he didn't win, Justin and his sister look at the business they started three years ago and can't believe how far they've come. Carlos Sosa, KRQE, News 13. Justin and his sister are already thinking of their next project, which will be a food lab. They say the goal is to teach students and adults how to cook.